Hi all, welcome back. In this video, we will see how to execute our Cypress uh, tests in Jenkins um, uh, as a pipeline project. Okay, so in my previous video, we have seen uh, how we can execute uh, our Cypress test as a uh, freestyle project. Uh, here we will see how to execute um, uh, our tests as a pipeline project okay so for that um, uh, what we need to do first uh, is uh, in our um, uh, github project or in our local so you need to create a jenkins file basically okay so in the jenkins file you need to name the file name as jenkins file itself okay it's a mandatory okay and after that um, we need to write a small uh, uh, json uh, formatted script there the first uh, it should be the file uh, need to write a pipeline and then uh, agent is a agent is any and then in the tools if you uh, notice in my previous uh, uh, video where we where we have executed our cypress tests in freestyle we have selected um, a node.js environment variable and we have uh, uh, given as node.js um, r21 so if you see there um, uh, if you go to uh, cypress and then configuration and then in the uh, node uh, npm node folder path we have given it uh, in the tools section we have given it as node.js 21 here or if you go to the dashboard there and in the uh, manage Jenkins and if you go navigate to the tools here and in the node.js installation section if you see we have configured uh, our node.js as um, node.js 21 okay so we need to provide this uh, name uh, the same name as uh, whatever the name that you have provided in the tools node.js uh, 21 in the tools section okay and then after that um, we are we need to create a stages here and uh, in the stages we need to create a stage we can create as many stages um, uh, we want so in the first stage i'm going to um, uh, install i'm going to install all the dependencies here so i i have named it as a dependencies um, so the name is up to you we can name uh, 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 anything uh, depend depends on the execution that we are doing in the step section so here if you see it is npm i which is uh, npm install so which means that we are installing the dependencies here and uh, in the same way i have created another stage here and there uh, we have written a steps there um, we are executing the cypress tests where we are running npm run cy colon cloud this is from package.json okay so you can create as many number of uh, stages there and we can provide multiple um, um, names also say suppose here we are using cy uh, colon cloud and if you want we can run cy colon uh, run also okay so let's uh, let's create uh, one more uh, stage also and uh, where we will uh, run cy colon uh, run okay if you go to jenkins and then uh, click on edit and then in the stage uh, copy the stage and then paste it here and we need we, the names cannot be the same in both the stages so we need to uh, rename it okay you need to provide a uh, different names here so here instead of cloud i can i'm using uh, npm run cy colon run okay so here we are having a uh, three stages okay the first stage is a dependencies installation and then in the second stage executing a cypress cloud and then in the third stage executing cy run okay and then i'm committing the changes here okay and then uh, i need to take this uh, url and if we navigate to uh, Jenkins there click on a new item uh, Cypress pipeline okay and then it is uh, not a freestyle project it is a pipeline project and click on ok once you click on um, ok you will get the configuration page 
okay so here uh, directly we need to run it as a pipeline so what we are going to do is a pipeline script from scm source control management so we are going to get all that information from gitlab github sorry github okay so it is a git and then we need to provide the url as as i have mentioned in my previous video so it should be the public repository otherwise you need to provide a credentials as well and then uh, the branch name is uh, main here not the master okay and uh, the script file is jenkins file here we have created a, a jenkins file here okay and it should be in uh, root uh, root location otherwise you need to specify the path and everything here so it is better to create um, a jenkins file in a, a root location okay and uh, once you set up everything here you can click on apply and then you can click on save once you save the uh, changes there you can see the build build now button and you can click on build now it is started uh, execution let's see what will happen here and and if you see here uh, in the cypress pipeline so in the first stage it is uh, uh, checking out the code from uh, uh, git uh, scm source control manager that is git and uh, we have uh, provided three stages after that uh, the second one is the tool installation that is uh, node.js uh, 21 and then the dependencies and then end to end tests so we will get the next step uh, after execution okay uh, in the first instance it is executing uh, uh, it is checking out and then um, uh, it will install the uh, dependencies and the tools and everything okay let's go to the core output console and see it is started executing um, things here okay And the first step is npm i, uh, which is a uh, uh, in npm install. And then uh, you can see in the second step, uh, in the second step we are running um, uh, npm run cy cloud. So here it has identified the uh, three spec files. So one, two executed, and third one is also completed here. And then you can see the output uh, it is executed four tests and all four tests are passed and after that we have uh, uh, given the other uh, um, a stage as npm uh, run cy run and it is started executing uh, uh, that command also so here if you see uh, i have given the same path in bo uh, both the location uh, both the steps here so if you go to package.json and uh, for cy.cloud and uh, and cy.run the tests are uh, uh, same the spec files it is going to pick from uh, tests one only apart from that uh, in cy cloud uh, i am just recording it to uh, cypress cloud but in cy.run i am not recording it to uh, cypress cloud here okay um, and if you go to the cy.run uh, you can provide if you want you can provide a, a different set of sections here if you want you can run a complete um, uh, cypress tests also uh, here you can see uh, the next stage is also um, completed successfully and the build is finished successfully so if you go to cypress pipeline you can see everything is um, here a uh, green status and uh, as i have mentioned we are also recording this in uh, cypress cloud if you go to cypress cloud here and then go to projects and if you see the projects here and see it was ran three minutes ago uh, update a, a jenkins file we have added a new uh, stage there so that's why uh, the commit has update uh, jenkins and you can see uh, that the tests are uh, failed we have run only four tests there okay and if you see i am nearing to uh, nine 
uh, I have reached the limit here uh, 93 percent uh, if you click on project and if you see the billing and usage um, so I have out of uh, 500 free tests I have already executed 467 tests okay uh, yeah uh, that is a side note and here um, you can see uh, we are logging um, our Cypress tests from uh, even from Jenkins also uh, to Cypress cloud okay uh, in this way you can uh, run our Cypress um, uh, tests uh, in Jenkins uh, as a pipeline project also okay thank you